I'm Miranda Paul from Green Bay, Wisconsin, and I'm going to be reading King and King. And the reason I chose this book is that when it came out, it was very groundbreaking. It's been challenged more times than I think any other picture book I know. And um, I think it's a fun story and I'd like to read it for you. King and King. On the tallest mountain above the town lived a queen, the young crown prince, and the crown kitty. The queen had ruled for many long years and she was tired of it. She made up her mind that the prince would marry and become king before the end of the summer. Wake up, called the queen. We're going to have a little talk, you and I. I've had enough. You're getting married and that's all there is to it. The prince pushed away his breakfast. He couldn't eat a bite as the queen talked on and on and on. I don't understand you. Every prince in these parts is married, every one of them but you. When I was your age, I'd been married twice already. By evening, all that talking had made the prince dizzy. Very well, mother, I'll marry. I must say, though, I've never cared much for princesses. To your future happiness! That night, the queen found her list of princesses and called every castle, Alcazar, and palazzo near and far. The very next morning, a crowd waited at the gates. Princess Arya from Austria sang a thunderous opera for the prince. No sooner had she finished than she was shown the door. Princess Dolly had flown all the way from Texas with her special magic act. The crown kitty was happy to exist, assist. But the queen and the prince were not amused. Next came the funny little princess from Greenland. The prince didn't hit it off with her either, so he really didn't mind when his page promptly fell in love with her. Boy, those long arms will certainly come in handy when waving to the people, said the prince. As, f as fast as her elegant legs could carry her, Princess Rajmash Putin from Mumbai stormed out of the palace. The queen and the prince looked at one another sadly. None of this was quite what they had expected.